certain things do apply to everybody and that's what I want to talk to you about today. A lot of people say that my approach, Joey's approach, is too aggressive, too direct, and too extreme. Well, they don't say too direct, actually. That's just the truth of it. It is just direct. But they say too extreme, too aggressive, making the vegan movement look bad. Everybody has the right to their opinion, but they don't have their right to facts. You can't tell Joey that he's not an effective activist. You can't tell him that he doesn't actually convince people to go vegan and to take animal rights seriously. If you try to claim that, you're a liar. You're lying to yourself and you're lying to everybody in this movement. So then what's really happening here? Why are people saying this then? If we're really effective in real life, why are people trying to tell us that we're not? That seems counterproductive, really, doesn't it? So the reality here is that people are projecting their own insecurities onto activists like me and Joey because they could never see themselves putting that much truth in that conversation they're having with someone and holding someone to account at that level. They see that as confrontational and perhaps fighting words. They think it's fighting words, like someone's going to fight you if you say this to them. Another thing I'm going to explain here is the difference between aggressive and violent because these two words have been conflated and people think that being aggressive means that you're violent, but it's not true. In fact, if you look at the definition of the word aggressive, it just means that you're driving forward and getting something done. People use that in sports all the time. Oh yeah, good quarter, he was really aggressive. Does he mean that he was violent and beating people up in that quarter? Obviously not, he just played with a lot of aggression and he got it done, right? So aggression is not a bad thing. In fact, if you look at what's happening to the animals and you don't feel angry, I would say see a psychologist. There's something wrong with you. If you're not angry, you're not paying attention. Anger is completely normal in this situation. Nobody should ever make you feel ashamed. Put your anger into activism. And the only thing that has given me fulfillment in my activism is effective activism. So when you put your anger into activism and you find success in your activism, you will feel fulfilled.